Hello, everyone. Today we're going to talk about how the food you select affects your brain. I am a neurologist and brain surgeon. I am a board certified and fellowship trained in cerebrovascular surgery and I am currently an assistant professor of neurosurgery at a major medical center. So today we're going to talk about how the food you select affects your brain. We'll talk about the Mediterranean diet and how that affects your brain and may actually increase your memory. We'll also discuss the relationship between processed meat consumption and dementia. If you're new here, I am a board certified and fellowship trained in cerebrovascular surgery and I am currently an assistant professor of neurosurgery at a major medical center. If you like what you see here, please make sure to follow before you leave. So let's get into it. How does the food you eat affect your brain? Well, the food you eat can affect your brain in a number of ways. One way is through the blood-brain barrier. The blood-brain barrier is a very interesting structure. It's formed by the endothelial cells that line the brain's vasculature. And these endothelial cells are connected by tight junctions. And this forms a very exclusive system where only certain things can get in and out of the brain. Another way is through the diet that you choose. So for example, the Mediterranean diet is a diet high in fruits, vegetables, whole grains and fish. And this type of diet has been shown to improve cognitive function and memory. In fact, there was a study done in 2013 that showed that the Mediterranean diet improved the memory of elderly individuals with mild cognitive impairment. On the other hand, processed meat consumption has been associated with an increased risk of dementia. So processed meat includes things like deli meat, hot dogs and bacon. And these meats are high in sodium and preservatives and have been linked to an increased risk of dementia. So what should you do? Well, you should focus on eating a balanced diet. That includes fruits, vegetables, whole grains and fish. Avoid processed meat and try to stick to unprocessed meat if you eat meat at all. I hope you guys found this helpful. If you did, please make sure to comment below and let me know what you want to hear next. Make sure to follow so you don't miss my next video. And if you want to learn more about the brain, make sure to check out my other videos. Thanks for watching. Guys, see you next time.